note. Oh, hey! I've been expecting you. I got something really cool to show you, but first, you're gonna need a pair of these. Safety first. Hey, what's up? This is what I wanted to show you. Take a look. This is a compressed air engine. It's only 8 inches long by 3 inches wide and only weighs 1.4 kilograms. Really greatly designed. Now the way it works is uh, we'd have an input of high pressure air here with a cylinder with a groove in the center which switches between these two holes. And these holes will transfer air via tube, which we'll see later, to this piston which is called our power piston. Now we want to make it spin as fast as possible so what we did is we made our strokes extremely small. Now another challenge we had was we want to change our rotational energy into linear energy. And to do this, you can see we have these cool little devices here and here called scotch yokes. So if you take a look, while we spin in a circle, it makes the shaft move in and out. It's pretty awesome, but it's even cooler when it's running. So let's go into the next room and take a look. Hey, glad you could join me. Just a little bit of engine prep before we're ready to run. A little bit of oil in our cylinders. Keep it nice and running smooth. We're going to be seeing that oil again. A little bit on our scotch yoke. And our shaft. All right. Looks like we're all ready to run. Hey, look at this baby run. She's really kicking right now. She's only about <laughs> 20 PSI and she's moving great. We could bring this thing up to almost over 1600 RPM. <laughs> it's amazing. We have an efficiency of 1100 plus. RPM per pound. Oh my gosh. This machine is really a great innovation at only 1.4 kilograms. You stay here. I'm going to go turn it up.